Good morning, Lucky Nation, and welcome to another beautiful day. All right, guys, today it is the biggest day ever. I have 66 miles to do, so for all my Canadian friends, that is 106 kilometers. I am crossing the California border. It is 7 a.m. right now. I am tired. The sun is rising. It's looking beautiful. I can't wait to show you guys once I get outside. But before I get this whole day started, for those of you that are new to the channel, my name is Lucky. I am currently cycling from Vancouver, BC to San Francisco in order to raise money for five cancer patients to help them pay financial bills where it's medication, supplements, food, whatever they might need help with. If you guys want to follow along this journey, just keep watching and enjoy the rest of the video. And for those of you guys that are back, a big thank you for being back. I really appreciate it. Let's get this day started. currently going uphill right now and from what I saw this is the biggest uphill of the day it is a total of close to 800 feet but you know what I like about uphills that I get to go downhill after and also that after this one the land is pretty flat until I get to my destination which is amazing always trying to see the positive side in a situation it's hard to go up but gonna go down it won't last forever and it's the only hill of the day so let's enjoy this hill while we have it and I'll see you guys once I come down all right guys I was right I've been riding all right guys I've been riding for two hours now and I forgot to put my trace into my water so I have this little concentrated bottle so basically it's plant-based minerals. So it's like electrolytes, vitamins, minerals, but that's all plant-based, which is awesome. Um, I usually add a tablespoon to each of my bottles while I'm writing, because it helps with recuperation and cramps. So let's just, let's just guesstimate that together. That's one tablespoon. It's a bit more than one tablespoon. And into this one too, bam. I've been adding this to my water every single day for the whole time that I've been writing and it does make a difference. Awesome. Let's mix those up. Ah. Ah, that good stuff. It just tastes like water. Also, I'm gonna have a cliff bar. But you know what I wish I had right now? A protein by Ben protein bar. So I had a cup, my friend Shannon gave me a bunch of them before I left for my trip. I ate some a little bit before my trip and I ate some at the beginning of my trip, but they were so good that I went through all of them really quickly. So now I'm stuck on cliff bars, but Shannon, I wish I had your bars right now. They are so good. All right, guys, I'm gonna hit this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna smash this food, and we're gonna hit the road. But first, look at where I stopped. Ah. It's so beautiful here. I'm tired. I have five more hours of riding to go, and it is... 10.30 a.m. Let's do this! Ah. Alright guys, I made it to Golden Beach and I decided to stop at the coffee shop just to eat my Nomad Nutrition meal because I need some hot water. I will also grab a coffee and I need a break because I've already biked 26 miles and it is currently 11.19 so I have 40 miles to go. So we're just going to fuel up and then hit the road again. Alrighty guys, we made it to Brookings Town. I am currently 10 miles away from my destination and I am super proud of myself because it is 3 p.m. I've been riding for seven hours and I did a total of 56 miles, which is like 90 some kilometers, my longest day to date. I'm not even done today. Right now what I'm looking for, I'm looking for some food. I'm looking for a postal office to ship some stuff out. 
but I just realized that we're Sunday, so it will be closed. So I'll have to do that tomorrow once I cross California. Right now, I think I'm gonna go into Fred Mayer's, which is right over there. I'm gonna go buy a little bit of snacks and stuff for tonight to eat because 106 kilometers involves a lot of calories. So let's do that. Let's see if I'm gonna meet up with other cyclists. As you saw in the clips, I met with one of them and I met with another couple that's been traveling for eight months. Here's the picture I took with them. So guys, if you're watching, it was really cool to meet you and good luck on the rest of your trip. So right now, I have to go to the bathroom, so let's head over to Fred Mayer's. All right guys, a little update. I went to Fred Mayer's and I bought just like five protein bars because there wasn't much there. And now I decided to treat myself. I am at a all-you-can-eat Mexican restaurant. I am going to pound the food. I'm starving right now. And I'm also super excited because I'm, I'm getting to cross California border today, which is awesome. And I'm just realizing that I might look like a raccoon. I think I have a little glasses tan right here. Uh-oh, it's happening. Anyways, let's lock up the bike. I'll be sure to sit right there because I don't want nobody taking my stuff. And let's head inside and start eating. You guys know what's going down. Salsa nachos. All right, guys, that was a good amount of food. Maybe it was a little bit too much. I'm having a little food baby right now. I have another 10 miles to bike. Let's see how the stomach handles it. Let's see how the legs handle it. The hardest part about this is when I stop and then restarting again, especially after 90 kilometers, like my legs are gonna burn. Anyways, enough about my legs. I'll see you guys once I get to the border. Hi right, guys, I made it. I'm officially in California. That's so exciting. So it took me 13 days in order to cross two states. And it's gonna take me 10 days to get to San Francisco. That's how long California is. So I'm about 18 minutes from my campsite right now, so I'll check in with you guys once I get there. All right, Lucky Nation, I made it to the camping right now. It is absolutely beautiful here. Look at this scenery. The sun is still high. It is currently 5.50, oh. It is currently 5.51 p.m. and we are already all set up. Got the tent, the bike is locked up there. You get our little sleeping bag set up in here. We have all the bags here. Uh, right now, all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go take a shower because oddly enough, it's been two days already. <laughs> so I'm gonna go take a shower, fill up my water bottles, and it's gonna be time to cook some food. Lucky Nation, as you saw, I am cooking my, well, boiling some water right now to have my Nomad Nutrition meal, but look at this sunset, so beautiful. So I'm just gonna FaceTime my girlfriend so I can enjoy this moment with her, and I'll check in with you guys after. All right, Lucky Nation, that's gonna be a wrap. I wanna say a big thank you for following this journey. Today was the biggest day I've ever done in my whole entire life, 106 kilometers. I'm proud that I finished it. I am also really exhausted, it is 7 p.m. and I'm heading off to bed because tomorrow I have another 50 mile day to do. So again, thank you for following this journey, thank you for supporting this journey and if you guys haven't checked it out yet, the first thing in the bio will be my GoFundMe link where you can hear about all the stories of the cancer patients that I'm helping and that you guys could be helping if you decide to donate as well. So thank you for watching, be sure to click that subscribe button to join the Lucky Nation and I will see you tomorrow morning. Peace.